What's going on YouTube? Listen, a couple of weeks ago, I tried to make my own pho following recipes that I saw off TikTok. I went to the Asian market and got one of these like spice packets. And then like I got a rotisserie chicken from Walmart. And I will say, although it was good, because I had never had pho, I didn't know what to compare it to. So today, I went and got like the real deal from this uh, restaurant called uh, Pho Galaxy. Um, so we're gonna try it for real, for real this time. I got the ribeye steak and it came with like all the toppings. Here, here goes the broth and here is the Oh, I guess this is raw. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Um, I wasn't expecting that. But the chili sauce. I got hoisin sauce, cilantro, lime, jalapenos. I think these bean sprouts. And my rice noodles. What I'm actually going to do, this is still hot. But what I'm actually gonna do is just heat it up just a little bit more. Yeah, while that's heating up, because I am gonna have to, yeah, this is raw, so I'll have to cook that in the um, the broth and then assemble everything. But just so y'all can see one more time, I got my rice noodles, bean sprouts, cilantro, lime, jalapenos, onions, then chili sauce and hoisin sauce. Oh, let me show y'all the ribeye too. Um, it's very, very thinly sliced. And what I'm doing now is just heating that broth back up and cooking this in the broth. I think I may have overcooked the ribeye just a little bit, but it's all right. All right, y'all got one of the, uh, a soup spoon from the Asian market got chopsticks I don't know how well I'm going to be picking up noodles I haven't mastered that with chopsticks so I got a fork as backup but let's go ahead and dress it up oh also too guys there's some green onion in here too green onion regular onion let's do a little bit of Cilantro, jalapeno, bean sprouts, a little bit of that. Let's do, you know what? Before I do that, let me just try the broth first. That's what I should have done. Just the broth. Oh yeah, hold on. This is nothing like what I tried that one time. <laughs> this is nothing like that. Okay, now let's dress it up with some sriracha, some hoisin sauce. I've never actually, at least I don't think I've had hoisin sauce before. Interesting. Not to be disrespectful, it kind of tastes like chocolate. I mean, not like chocolate, chocolate. Like a, I don't know. It's good though. It's sweet. Let me get a little lime. Ooh, let's roll. Okay. Another thing, the last time I, um, when I tried my pho, I did not 
do something with my noodles right. Uh, they just, the noodles wasn't right. And this right here, these noodles are cooked perfectly. I like that. Let's try to give, so let me get a little, little bit of the ribeye. Thinly sliced ribeye. Like I said, I think I just overcooked it, but it's okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's get a little ribeye. A little onion. A little jalapeno. Grab a jalapeno. A little bit of sauce, stir it up in there. I like that. I'm gonna add a little bit more cilantro to it. This is very, um, oh, did I add bean sprouts? I don't know if I did or not. Pickle some more, some green onion. The soup is very comforting, if that describes anything. It's very warm. I've seen people twirl the noodles onto their spoon and then put it in their mouth. I'm not there yet. I'm not there yet. The broth is very, flavorful. I wish I had another lime though. That lime is, this lime is kind of taking it to the next level. Just a little bit. The onion in it is just absorbing that broth. Get them all in here. And see, I'm a soup type of guy. Soups, stews, noodles. This is right up my alley. Now, at this particular place, you had the option to get uh, two meats or you, you could have gotten chicken. Uh, you could have gotten seafood. Um, there was a lot of different options. <clears throat> I just stuck with the classic. I'm so glad that I gave this a second try because I didn't think I would have liked rice noodles. Now, if you're not a big fan of cilantro, I wouldn't advise putting the cilantro in your pho. I think people either like cilantro or they hate it. There's no like in between. And I like cilantro. All right. This ain't no mukbang. So I'm finna log off, finish this up, and I'll see y'all later.